In a groundbreaking development that has sent shockwaves throughout the entire electric vehicle industry, two automotive powerhouses, Tesla and Toyota, have joined forces in an insane new partnership. Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, publicly expressed his long-standing desire for Toyota, the automotive giant, to unite with the esteemed NACS union. This unexpected collaboration promises to revolutionize the EV landscape, unleashing a wave of innovation and setting new standards for the industry. How will this collaboration leverage Tesla's expertise in electric vehicle technology and Toyota's manufacturing prowess? What will be the impact on the market share and competitive landscape of other EV manufacturers? Can we expect groundbreaking advancements in battery technology and range capabilities from this alliance? Let's find out. Elon Musk has called upon Toyota to join the growing coalition of automakers adopting Tesla's North American charging standard. This invitation comes in the wake of several prominent automakers and charging companies committing to embrace the NACS North American Charging Standard Connector, revolutionizing the EV charging landscape. The momentum for this groundbreaking shift began with Ford, which became the first major automaker to announce its transition to Tesla superchargers without the need for an adapter by 2025. This game-changing partnership means that customers of Ford and General Motors, GM, will have the privilege of utilizing Tesla's remarkable charging infrastructure, comprising approximately 17,000 stations across the United States. Out of the 17,000 stations, Ford and GM customers will have access to an impressive 12,000 superchargers, while the remaining 5,000 stations will be exclusive to Tesla owners. Tesla superchargers are renowned for their exceptional capabilities, allowing users to add up to 200 miles of range in just 15 minutes. Moreover, Tesla ensures that charging stops are brief and convenient, typically limiting charging needs to 80% to optimize efficiency for their customers. Charging companies such as ChargePoint, Blink, and ChemPower have also pledged their support for the NACS connector, recognizing the collective progress toward advancing EV charging technologies and best practices. While the NACS has yet to be officially standardized by Sharian, the governing body focused on transportation electrification, it is anticipated that more major automakers will embrace this strategy in the near future. To enable their electric vehicles to seamlessly connect with the Tesla supercharger network, Ford and GM have committed to adopting Tesla's charging connector. This means that owners of Ford and GM EVs will only need to purchase an adapter, costing approximately $100 to tap into Tesla's extensive charging infrastructure. Not only does this development signify a triumph for Tesla, opening new revenue streams, but it also establishes Tesla's charging plug as the emerging industry standard. Currently, two charging standards coexist in North America, Tesla's NX, North American Charging Standard, and the combined charging system, CCS, utilized by other automakers. The CCS, employing a slower charging connector, is predominantly employed by public charging networks. However, fast charging stations within the CCS network are scarce, with only 7,400 stations currently supporting the CCS connector. While no car maker, besides Ford and GM, has joined Tesla's coalition thus far, Elon Musk has extended an invitation to Toyota, encouraging them to embrace this transformative collaboration. By aligning with Tesla's NACS, automakers can enhance the accessibility and convenience of EV charging infrastructure, benefiting the entire industry and facilitating the transition to sustainable transportation. To address the evolving market demands and enhance driving range, Toyota recently announced its plans to produce high-performance solid-state batteries, aiming to reduce EV production costs. This move reflects Toyota's commitment to transitioning toward electric mobility while ensuring competitive driving range for their vehicles. Toyota's decision to heed this call to action has the potential to ignite a wave of transformation in the automotive industry. Other major automakers, such as Kia, Hyundai, and Stellantis, might be prompted to follow suit in order to maintain their competitive edge. However, Volkswagen remains steadfast in its commitment to the CCS Combined Charging System Charger, with plans to expand its charging network to 1,680 stations by 2026. The significance of the charging network cannot be understated in the electric vehicle landscape. 
the automaker that can offer long-lasting battery capabilities, enabling drivers to embark on extended journeys without frequent recharging, coupled with an extensive network of fast charging stations, holds a distinct advantage. Tesla's market dominance can be attributed, in part, to its supercharger network, which was initially established out of necessity when no other charging infrastructure existed. By extending their network to rival automakers, Tesla demonstrates a willingness to share its advantage while simultaneously securing a vital revenue stream. Moreover, Tesla's charging connector, now on the path to becoming the industry standard, reinforces its leadership position. Elon Musk emphasized this point, stating, We built the supercharger network out of desperation since no one else was doing it. With Tesla leading the way, the future of electric mobility is poised for remarkable progress. As more automakers embrace the Nasius connector and join forces with Tesla, the collective effort will drive the expansion and accessibility of EV charging infrastructure. This collaborative approach not only benefits the industry as a whole, but also paves the way for a more sustainable and convenient driving experience. In other exciting news, Tesla's CEO Elon Musk recently made a significant announcement about the production timeline of the highly anticipated Tesla Semi. During a conference held in Austin, Musk revealed that volume production of the electric semi-truck won't start until late 2024, marking a delay in Tesla's previous plans. Initially, Tesla had aimed to build 50,000 units of the semi in 2024, but now it seems that production won't kick off until the latter part of next year. During the Q3 2022 earnings call, Musk had outlined the company's strategy for the semi, expressing intentions to ramp up production throughout 2023 and initiate volume production in 2024 with the goal of manufacturing 50,000 units that year. However, the recent update indicates a slight deviation from these plans, pushing the timeline further into the future. One of the primary reasons for the delay in semi-production is the constraint in battery supply. Although Tesla is expanding its Nevada production facility to support the manufacturing of the truck, battery availability remains a critical factor affecting the production timeline. Musk acknowledged these challenges during his conference speech. It's worth noting that Tesla has received substantial interest in the semi, with several prominent companies placing orders for the electric truck. Walmart, Anheuser-Busch, UPS, DHL and other organizations are eagerly awaiting their delivery. However, the delay in volume production may result in a delay in the initial delivery dates for these customers. Once the Tesla semis hit the roads, they are expected to contribute to more sustainable commercial fleets, aligning with the global drive towards environmentally friendly transportation solutions. Tesla's expansion plans also include the establishment of new manufacturing plants, such as one in Mexico expected to begin construction before the end of this year. These strategic initiatives aim to boost overall vehicle production capacity and cater to the growing demand for Tesla's electric vehicles. The delay in volume production of the Tesla Semi certainly poses challenges for both Tesla and its customers. However, with the company's ongoing efforts to address battery constraints and expand production facilities, there is optimism for a successful ramp-up in the coming years. The wait for the Tesla Semi may be prolonged, but the promise of a greener future in the commercial transportation sector remains unwavering. In a groundbreaking turn of events, Mercedes-Benz, one of the leading automakers in the world, is reportedly considering adopting Tesla's North American charging standard. This potential move positions Mercedes-Benz as the next major automaker to embrace Tesla's charging connector, following in the footsteps of Ford and General Motors. The decision by Ford and General Motors to adopt Tesla's NSS connector for their vehicles starting in 2025 has sent shockwaves through the industry. This announcement has not only sparked similar commitments from charging companies like Blink and ChargePoint, but has also piqued the interest of other prominent car manufacturers. Just recently, Stellantis was contemplating the adoption of the NAX connector, adding to the growing list of companies considering joining what Tesla CEO Elon Musk refers to as the NACS coalition. Now, reports from Benzinga indicate that Mercedes-Benz is also evaluating the possibility of incorporating the NACS connector. 
the company is actively exploring a technical implementation that would enable its vehicles to connect seamlessly with Tesla superchargers. If an agreement is reached, the reason behind Tesla's push for widespread adoption of its charging connector becomes clearer. When considering Tesla's mission to accelerate the transition to sustainable energy, its unique advantage lies in its ownership and operation of the most extensive charging network globally, with over 45,000 locations. Unlike other charging companies that have faced dependability issues, Tesla's supercharging network provides reliability and convenience, making it an attractive option for potential EV buyers. For automakers, the desire to enhance customers' charging and ownership experience is a driving force behind the consideration of Tesla's charging connector. By adopting the NACS connector, these companies gain access to a robust, dependable, and expansive charging infrastructure that aligns with the evolving needs of electric vehicle owners. The move signifies a collaborative effort in shaping a future where sustainable transportation is accessible to all. So, what are your thoughts about Tesla's and Toyota's new partnership? Share with us in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, show us some love by hitting that like button and leaving a comment down below. Also, if you're a fan of all things technology, be sure to check out this other video we've got lined up for you. It's packed with all the latest news, tips, and tricks to keep you ahead of the curve.